can't believe that I've even been nominated and now I've won this. I'm genuinely over the moon and so humbled because my main concern was putting across a real story and that people believe our story and that they think it was genuine enough. Um, so the fact that people have rang up and voted for me as a performer, I couldn't have asked for anything else. I'm so happy right now. It's just the cherry on top of the cake. It really is, yeah. And then um, what's coming up in the future for you? Um, I've got some personal projects that I just want to do myself. And I've had some weird and wonderful meetings for various things. But it all it's all time dependent, depending what direction I want to go in. Um, and we'll just see what happens. And Coronation Street is having such a moment. And, you know, you can't help but think, you know, might it win tonight? We don't know. But, you know, it must be so weird almost leaving such a cast like that it is weird it's bittersweet because i wanted to leave for my own ambition i just wanted to try new things and because i wanted to do this story and the best way to have done this story is how we've done it which sadly means i can't come back but i'm i love everyone there i'll cherish all my time that i've had there i'll miss everyone but I remember it, I've learnt so much there um, and I'm just grateful for every minute that I've been able to be there. You know, and they do kind of have um, Sinead up on screen occasionally. Do you think if they ever do a flashback episode you'd be up for it? Yeah, and if Sinead, and if Sinead had an evil twin sister. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what would she be up to? <laughs> oh, all sorts. I've, got, I've written a book already about her. <laughs> oh, I'll let you go and celebrate. Thank, thank you, you so thank much. Thank you so much.